Hi YouTube, this is just a quick video because I'm going hammock camping tonight so I've laid up the bike with a sleeping bag, hammock, under quilt and tarp and a load of other bits and pieces like food I'm going to set the um, trip meter on the mileometer to naught and see how far it, it is to where I'm going Catch you soon Just on my way as you can see Cruising long full battery Three and a half miles into the journey Scout an incline on the fly over the new A14 to Cambridge. But yeah, still pulling up the hills and obviously pedal assisting as well. Fully loaded. We're on our way. What a nice day. Lovely little back road here. Brampton Woods on the right, it's a big ancient wood but you can't camp in there, it's got private. Oh, that's just the area, isn't it? What a nice little walk. The trees are all coming out in blossom, old people. Cars coming on, then it's like stop recording. Temperature's meant to get down to minus tonight, so I've got a new sleeping bag, a 500 GSM field, so I'm hoping I'll be snug in it tonight. I've got my little fire pit anyway. A little twig stove to get going. It's a lovely little bit of road just going around. Go under the bridge in a minute. Give the whole motor a bit of a rest. What are we on? Five and a half miles now. Done. Lovely little bridge. It's got some midgets in my eye. I'm getting close to the water. It's coming down to Grafton Waters. Uh, I've done 7.1 mile on the speedo, but I didn't set it for the first mile, so it's about 8 miles so far. We have craft and waters here on the left. Left in quite a little spot. Nearly there. That's a little bit of old railway again. Picked up one. Looking a bit different since I last come down here. About a month or ago. It's really green and up. As you can see the bike handles the train fairly easy even loaded up. I'm hoping the spot which I get to be nice and quiet. Just seen a couple walkers out and the bags on. Hopefully they're just day bags. Watch out for the old fawn. I should be upgrading my motor soon. Um, 
Kevin from Mince Disciples is sending me out a 500 watt and a new rear tyre and a new throttle lever. I'm hoping that I'll get a review in on them soon. Like I say, the 250 is plenty of power for everything, for what you need. I struggle a tiny bit uphill, so hopefully this new motor just have a bit more torque and um, new controller as well. A bit more amps. Right, I've just got to my spot. Um, it's nine miles to here, so I'm just about to set up in between these two trees here, I think. Zoom up a bit. They look pretty good. No dead up there. All round. So, yeah. See when I'm set up. All right, I'm all set up now. Got a little fold away fire pit and I've got a little Twig stove boiled my kettle, but I've got um, a little homemade alcohol stove in there at the minute just for convenient how to eat until I get some twigs. Uh, there's my hammock underneath my tarp, all nice, start with my under blanket, my sleeping bag, and my bike's across here, which I've got another little tarp. I'll lay that flat later and just put that little camo tarp over the top just in case it gets rain or if it hasn't forecasted rain. but. Yeah, that's me for tonight. Time to light the fire and get some dinner on. Before it gets dark, it's um about half six now, seven o'clock. Yeah, six forty-five, so still got about an hour and a half of light. Lovely. Right, better make that tea before that water pours away. <laughs> Abs ready and yum yum. I've got my flint and steel here. I made some charcoal up. Right, great stuff this is. It's just made out of a denim. We'll get on the best bit of flint and hopefully we will. Great stuff, is this? Get a little birds in the sky. Looking nice now, they're in um, home tray, so I'm going to empty the out, I've just got one more side of them still. A little fire dry right down these great little fire pits, little mesh ones, off eBay about 17, 18 quid. The only thing is I did find, I've got, got a new mesh on this one because the old one I use them colour changing flame things and I think they've got sulphur in, so they've corroded with holes in the metal. But I hope this one holds up a bit better. No metal nails in it for when I'm burning with at home. The sunset's coming down now. Lovely. Hopefully about ten minutes they'll be done. So it's great little five pits. So I've just got back home the next morning. It's a lovely morning again. I think I'm going to get the paddleboard out. 
Um, I did 17 miles, so about 18 miles, and it's still got one battery bar left, but that normally does a good 10 mile on that, so it's not done bad loaded up. Um, and I'll catch you for my next review when I've hopefully got my 500 watt motor and my um, new tyre. Thanks for watching, catch you next time.